Building New with Sarah, sponsored by Eastbrook Homes. It is the American dream, owning your own home. But imagine building your dream home from the bottom up. Every fixture and finish is yours to select. You're about to meet a very special family doing just that. And we're gonna follow along and share in the experience. So what do you say, let's get started. Building New with Sarah. Sarah Wilkins is no stranger to hard work and new beginnings. The Holland Hospital pathologist is open about her personal struggles, all of which demanded a starting over of sorts, becoming a mom at a young age. She got pregnant her junior year in high school. In my community, in my family, this was a really, really bad thing, and it was uh, very difficult. Still, she had a plan, so she finished junior year with correspondence courses and a teacher she'll never forget. My math teacher one day says, okay, Sarah, what are you gonna do with the rest of your life now? And I said, well, I'm gonna be a doctor. And he looked me in the eyes and he said, you need to be more realistic. Sarah ended up getting married and had two more babies, three kids by the age of 22. And yet she graduated high school, went to college, and was admitted to medical school. She says her husband turned out to be abusive, and she realized it would be more harmful to stay than get out. So she made an exit plan during that first year of medical school and moved into a small apartment with three young kids. You know, people say, how did you do that? But I just didn't have a choice. I was the provider. Eventually, there was a second marriage, residency, fellowship, a fourth child, and a move to Holland for her first job. She loved the community. Still love it, have zero plans of going anywhere until they kick me out, you know. <laughs> it's just a great place to work, and, and my colleagues are fantastic. And then her second marriage destroyed by infidelity. While it was devastating and she grieved the loss of her dreams, she knew it was time for yet another fresh start. Three of her children were grown, so she and her young Kane moved to a condo in downtown Holland. I shushed it all up, made it look gorgeous. I love it. And it was very comfortable for us. Um, it's been a great spot for us. But space was at a premium and Kane is now 13. So another new start as Sarah began the search for a new home. On the list of must-haves, space for Kane and his friends to hang out, a big yard for outdoor activity, and a pool definitely a pool. And so I started looking at existing homes and nothing was grabbing my attention. I don't want to live there. I don't want to live there. Until I came across one particular home which was gorgeous and then when I called she said oh that's a home to be built. And so I was like oh okay um you know well tell me a little bit more and and I need space. Turns out that was an Eastbrook home, and the woman who answered the call was Maureen Smith at Makatawa Legends. Maureen says, just drive around, see if there's any place you like. I said I wanted a pool. She said, these are the ones you could have pools on. And I found my perfect spot that I was immediately in love with. It's an acre lot, trees in the back, so we don't have a house right beside us. And I was like, this is and so Kane and Sarah will leave behind their downtown Holland condo in favor of resort-style living in the estates at Makatawa Legends. Finally, a carefree lifestyle with room to stretch out. As for that teacher who tried to crush her dreams all those years ago? I don't think I did this because of what he said. I feel like I did it in spite of what he said. And I've never in my mind said, I'm going to do it because he said I couldn't. That's never been my attitude. Very, very strongly want people to realize that no matter what your situation is, you can change it. Is it going to be easy? No, not at all. But if you're willing to put that work in, you can do whatever you want to do. I just, that message is so important to me. It is also important to Sarah to tell people who may be experiencing abuse there is help available. Contact the National Domestic Violence Hotline at 800-799-7233 or visit safehavenministries.com. Next time, the lot has been selected and it's time to choose a floor plan as we continue Building New with Sarah.